Hi everyone, I'm Summer and today I'm excited to share with you how you can boost your revenue with upsells. This is something you want to implement in all of your stores from the beginning and this is how it would look once you've installed Cartex. So the first thing we need to do before setting up this upsell is to enable all of these settings really quick. So we click here to activate the theme extension and it's going to open our theme into another tab. Then you activate Cartex and click on save. Then we go back over to the original tab and once you click activate, you'll see that the activation notification goes away. Once done, we need to enable the app onto the checkout so they will open all of our admin settings here. All you have to do is select Cartex as your main post-purchase upsell app and then click save. Again, click refresh and now Cartex is activated. Here you can see the first page takes you to the dashboard. Now this shows you figures such as your return on investment, total orders and your average upsell order value. This is a great way to see your overall performance and you can even compare from today, all time, seven days, one month and three months. Now we're going to click on the funnel section and then add new funnel. You can actually give your funnel a name. So in our case, we're going to call it test funnel, but in any case, your customers will never see the name of this. So you can call it whatever you like. Now we can choose to create an automatic funnel using the money machine, which I would recommend, or you can start from scratch and create this manually. For this video, I'm going to start from scratch. So the first thing we have to do is choose when your upsell funnel is going to appear inside your store. There are a lot of options that we can go through, but the most common ones are applying it for all products, a specific product or collection. So what this essentially means is if you apply this to all products, then this upsell funnel will be displayed to every single customer no matter what. Or we can choose to show this funnel only for a specific product or specific collection. This is great if you have a multi-niche store and you want to personalise your customer experience. And of course you can include or exclude languages, countries and many more. For this tutorial I'm going to apply this funnel to all products. Now we can take a look at pop-up upsells which appears when a customer adds their product to cart. To demonstrate the contrast of how your store will look, this is what happens when you add a product to cart before using Cartex. As you can see, there are no offers presented to the customer yet. With Cartex, you can actually add up to three different pop-up upsells, and here I would recommend using a low-ticket product because this won't create friction at the checkout process for the customer. For example, if you own a jewelry store, you could sell a premium box for $7.99. In this tutorial, we'll add a premium shipping option. This is because this can be applied to almost every store and it's a digital product, which means you make 100% profit. As you can see here, you can even configure the design of this pop-up upsell with colour, text, style and plenty more for it to look seamless for your store. Once you're happy with your design and gone through these tabs, then click save. Now if we go back to the website, you can see that once we add a product to cart, your pop-up upsell will appear here for the customer. Now we can jump into the one-click upsells and these upsells show once the checkout process is completed. This is great because the customers have already entered their bank details and won't need to again. So the customer is able to accept these one-click upsells without having to enter any of their bank details again as this has already been taken in the initial checkout process. For this demonstration, as you can see, once you complete the checkout process before using Cartex, there are no offers presented. So we set the first upsell to insurance and the downsell to the most expensive product with 20% off. Select save and then you can configure your design again. Here, you are, as you can see, you are able to alter the design of this through these five different options at the top. This includes product options and then you can also choose to select the headline which you can see here and then you can also choose discount shipping. To add your 20% off, simply select add discount and then change the discount value to 20% and then click save. Then go back to the page. This really is the best upsell app that you can boost your revenue by 30% instantly. And it's worth noting that this is the only Shopify application where you can add up to six one-click upsells within this same funnel. Again, you are able to configure this design exactly how you would like it, with the text, background, you can put the timer on or off, and plenty more. You can even see what the design will look like from your phone, computer, and other devices. Now we press save and refresh the website, and once the customer has checked out, they will now have up to six pop-up upsells offered to them. You can see here they can again either decline or accept the offer and not have to enter their bank details. This in turn increases your average order value. Now we can take a look at the thank you page. This is going to show after the customer checkouts. Here we are going to choose the least expensive product with 20% off. So what you have to do is click save and then press configure design. As you can see at the top of this page, there are five different tabs you can choose from. You have general settings, product options, buttons, discount and shipping, and the right section. To add the 25% off, you click the add discount tab and then you change the number to exactly what you'd like, in this case, 25. Then you can scroll down and see what it would look like on the page, and then you simply click save. Did you know the customer on average comes back to the thank you page three times per order? So you want to make sure you're doing these two main things. 
Number one is reducing customer support. This could be shown through social proof such as reviews, FAQs, all added in this right section. You want to ensure that your customers are happy after leaving your checkout experience. Add these to the right section, simply click add widget and then you can choose which one you'd like to add. If you'd like a review, you just click add review and then you can change the text and the star rating and many more. And number two is increasing your repeat customers. Show more offers to customers in the left section using different variations and styles so that they come back and shop more. As you can see here, the offer that we just made was a gift card and then we can also add an FAQ here. You can change the text then click add FAQ and it'll show up in the right section, then just click save. They could buy now or they can keep it in the top of their mind for their next visit to your store. You can now see on the updated thank you page using Cartex, we have the FAQs for people to look through and the reviews. And now for the analytics. This is a perfect way to see exactly what is working well for your business through all of this data. As you can see, this shows you your top performing funnels, your top selling products and even dives into your sales and customer data. Another great analytic here is you can even see your average upsell value, which shows how much Cartex is actually bringing into your Shopify store. Now you may be wondering how the pricing works. Well, the app is so profitable that it actually pays for itself. For example, you pay $9.99 and you make at least $200 and your payment plan only goes up when your orders do. So it's a win-win. Cartex really is a great way to boost your revenue through your Shopify store. Thank you for listening to this tutorial and if you have any questions at all, please feel free to contact our 24-7 customer support.